Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Nalinga Koei. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate it. So today I'm going to do a green and gold eyeshadow tutorial and um, you know green and gold go together, growth and riches go together. So yeah, let's enjoy the video and see you at the end of the video. So for those of you who've been following me, you know the drill, you know the drill. We are, I, I start by defining my fake brows because basically I don't have any hair on my brows. So I always draw them or fill them in. And uh, yeah, I'm using the LA Girl Pro Conceal Concealer in the shade phone to define my brows. And I love defining my brows with this concealer because it, it has a good applicator for defining brows. You know, no stress. And I'm just using a, a blending brush just to like blend it out so that at least it can like blend in with the skin. And I'm using an eyeshadow base that is actually white and it's the illegal uh, eyeshadow base. Uh, I love the white one because it makes the colors really bright. And I'm just taking this bright yellow shade and I'm just applying it like all over my eyelids, all over like to cover it completely. So just apply it all over your eyelid, like completely all over the eyelid. It's going to be like a base color. And now I'm just taking this dark green. It's a very dark green yeah, color. And I'm just applying this dark green color on the outer corners of my eyes and also the, the of my eyelids specifically and also like the crease of my eyelids i'm not going to apply it in the inner corner of my quick now i'm just taking this color from a LA, it's like a it's like a yellow a very pale yellow color and it has flecks of shimmer in it from the LA colors um it's a palette called the circus palette by the way, the previous palette that I was using was the miss rose which is like a chinese company but i love their matte colors very good so i'm just applying that pale gold color just below my eyebrows to define them so that um, they can pop more and now i'm just taking this shimmery miss rose gold palette it's like a shimmer palette by miss rose so i'm just applying that gold all over uh, the lower part of my eyelid apart from the outer corner where i applied the green as you can see in the video i'm just applying it like from the inner corner towards the green color no shade you just apply even with your finger for as long as it's applying it's applying So now I'm just taking a blending brush and I'm just blending, trying to blend out all the colors, specifically the green one towards the eyebrows and the yellow one. So I'm just, as you can see, I'm just using like circular motion to like blend it out so that it blends out well and it doesn't have harsh lines. So now I'm just taking a gold eyeliner. And I'm just going to create a wing using that gold eyeliner. Although this specific gold eyeliner was clamping a lot, so it gave me a really hard time. But it's a gold eyeliner. You can use any gold eyeliner. Uh, just apply it like the way you do a normal uh, wing. So I'm just creating a normal wing. And then now after creating that normal wing, I'll go over it with a black eyeliner as you're going to see in the next step. I'll just outline that gold eyeliner with now a black one. So this is what I was talking about. I'm just using this Maybelline black eyeliner to just go over that gold one, as you can see. Yeah, creating like the outline for the gold one. That's exactly what I'm doing.
now i'm just taking my, my foundation and i'm just using the revlon um pecan foundation there yeah, the color is pecan and i'm just uh i've applied it now i'm just blending it in like yeah you know the main focus of this video was actually this gold eyeshadow because i love this eyeshadow so much gold is just a beautiful color even green if you use it well and you know green brown they go together you know we, we dark people we are brown we are black we are all colors by the way so yeah anyway um i'm just patting the eyeshadow in it's not good for you to to brush like you're brushing as if you're brushing shoes or teeth no just pat it in with the brush and it will be okay <laughs> Yeah, and I'm going to highlight and contour my face and I'm just using this NYX contour stick. So I'm just highlighting like the center of my face, below my eyes and also uh, like my, my jawbone. That's where I normally highlight. And then I'm going to also contour my cheekbones. And I'm also going to use a brush to just pat it in the same way I patted in the foundation. And after the brush, I'm just going to use a beauty blender because a beauty blender just finishes the finish so perfectly. And we can't forget to set it so we are going to use the sasha setting powder yes sasha buttercup setting powder which i love so much yeah so just applying it in the areas i want to pop i'm going to highlight my lips this, this was not necessary because i'm not applying any lipstick i'm just applying gloss as you're going to see i'm just using this mm, very very transparent gloss it has like flecks of shimmer in it so i just decided to cover up the excess highlight with a brown pencil so that it can look more natural and now i'm just removing the setting powder so that yeah we can look normal Yeah, and, and I'm just taking that Maybelline powder that you've seen. It's a setting powder, a Maybelline setting powder, and I'm just applying it all over my face just to set my entire face. Uh, those areas that I didn't put the Sasha Buttercup. So as you can see, I'm just setting my entire face with it. So I think this look is just <clears throat> bomb, especially in real life, not my shoddy camera that I have, but it's, it's a beautiful one. You should try it yourself and let me know in the comment section.